everybody. I'm here today to share with y'all a project that I did, well, a group swap that I'm in over on Facebook with Tiffany McGill, which is Coffee, Cake, and Crafting. She is celebrating her B-Day, Born Day. Um, I think it's the 40th or 41st. But anyway, um, part of her theme is fun and fabulous and flirty. You didn't necessarily have to... Um, use birthday stuff so but she wanted it you know this is personally for her and she had different elements to this swap um she wanted one card kit a set of four embellishments a pennant banner a hand sanitizer holder and a tag which which had to be specifically pink tan white and gold and last any um you could make any craft fair item that could be anything so um, I'm going to show y'all a few things that I use to make this swap, and, and then I'll show you what I made. I use this shine stamp from Recollections, this tree stamp from Spellbinders. I love this die. I used one of the, um, uh, what are these? Elena Cuddle um, tag dies. I used that heart Sizzic die. I use this bag topper die. I use this Derice embossing folder. I use this cottage cut bow die. And I use these little stickers. And I use this bow die. And I use this little like teacup die. And also I use this 49 and market paper um i got this from tuesday morning we still have a tuesday morning here but i've i've had it for i've had it for a minute and it came with eight sheets so i just used various sheets um yeah i didn't use it throughout the whole swap but i, I used some pieces of it so those are some of the items that i use to um do the swap so let's start with the card here is my card. Now, Tiffany requ uh, requested that you do like a sample. So I just, instead of making four cards, I make three, one for her and two for my swap par partners. I just put hers together so she could see what it looked like. But here is how my partners will get theirs. It's all the elements to the card. And I actually added two sentiments. And that was one of the requirements too. You had to have two layers or more, one embellishment, one sentiment. But I um, stamp and matted two sentiments. One says congratulations, other one just a note. And then I added some little foam dots because I um, used those to raise the tree a little bit and the little background. And then here's the inside. So that's the card. Second is the um, embellishments. And here are my embellishments. I used that bow die and I added um, this uh, rosette here. I didn't make that, that was from a swap. But I added some little tool sticking out here and I um, stickled the tool. And then over here, these little mini envelopes um, are from Amber with Spotted Elk. I just um, added the tool and stickled it and then stickled all the way around it, the flowers and stuff. And then on this one, here's some stickers. I think these are recollection stickers. I'm not sure. So I added that with some tool and stickled them. And then these little butterflies are from Dollar Tree. And then there's another one of those stickers and the tool and the stickles. So those are my elements, bag toppers. And then next we have the pennant, the pennant banner. And here is my banner. And I think, I guess it came out okay. Well, more than okay, I guess. <laughs> and she said she wanted everything blinged up. So I tried to stickle these to death. So those are those, um, I don't know if I showed y'all the heart die. I think that's the Sizzix heart die. And I just doubled them back there. And then here's some more of the um, rose gold tool. And I just stickled that. And these are those Dollar Tree butterfly uh, stickers. I just doubled them up. And then there's the word shine. 
and then we got some little flat backs and then I just stickled them and then here is the um, little doilies like burb what is it I don't know yeah doilies in the back so there is my banner that's the back and then next is the hand sanitizer holder here is what I made I just um, got a tutorial off of YouTube there's like a zillion of them out there so and uh, I know Tiffany's colors are pink tan white and gold for one of the elements so I basically just put that throughout the swap so here's my banner here is those little Hobby Lobby um, little glitter leaves and I just took some uh, gold marker and kind of, you know, highlighted areas on it. And then there is that bow dye. So, yeah, I thought that was cute. These are the Perel um, spray hand sanitizers. So I thought that was cute. And then next we have the tag. And um, she specifically said two inches wide three inches long I tried to get it as close as I could um, to the measurements that she wanted so here is my tag and if y'all know Tiffany this is her favorite word believe so there it is and here is that bow again here's some tool and then at the bottom I just re um, cut this just to add an element to the tag and then on the back, there's a to and from. And last, we had to make a craft fair item. So what I made was a notepad. Well, I covered one. These are the 150-page um, notepads from the Dollar Tree. And I just covered it. And then I fussy cut out little... Um, from the paper pad, the, the paper pad that I showed you, I just cut out and backed it up with some gold foil paper. And then I printed off or cut off on my uh, Cricut the word believe. But this is the paper from that um, paper that I showed you, which is from 49th and Market. So that is all the elements to the swap and then for some extra goodies I, I'm sending her some gummy bears two big packs of gummy bears and I just added that bow on top with the little steaming like coffee or tea just something extra and for my swap partners I added for them these are Kit Kats and I just wrapped them and there's that bow again and then underneath is some hearts I had a bunch of these left from um, a couple of years ago with Hobby Lobby clearance so I just added those so that they'll get these and then Tiffany will get these so yeah that is what I made I hope Tiffany and my partners like what I made and I will show y'all at the end of the video how I packaged it thank y'all for watching bye bye